Our first look at Rescue Wheels, Paw Patrol's upcoming sub-series is here, and we'll go over everything we have today. First up, we'll be talking about Roxy. Before now, we had only seen her in promotional content, so it's really nice to finally see her animated. I'll give you a few clips of her in action. Hey, Adventure Bay! I hope you're ready to rock! Hang on, Chocolata. I'm gonna try something. Sticky Star Tires! Maybe if I just go slow. Thanks for dropping in. Wanna see something cool? Press that button. She is voiced by Mia Swami Nathan. Fun fact, her older sister Tiana voices Roria the Cat Pack, and her younger sister Michaela voices Lily and Rebel and Crew. Honestly, I had expected Roxy to have a bit of a deeper voice, but I think her current one fits her too. For anyone wondering, Roxy's breed is a Samoid. Next up, we'll be taking a look at Boomer. The only other time we had seen him was in the form of a toy, just shortly before, so this is our first time seeing him in the Paw Patrol style. Take a look at him. Thank you, thank you very much. <clears throat> ah, that's better. Now I just need some real fans around here to cheer my name. Hey, you! Yeah, close enough. You mean Roxy? That's the one. Ah, if those people want to see stunts, they should come see me. Here! <laughs> hey, I've got an idea. Drive on top of these buildings, then everyone inside will get to be in my show. Great idea, huh? Now that you've seen him, I think Boomer's personality seems like a mix of Gasket from the Rough Rough Packs and Claws from the Rescue Knight subseries. By the way, he's voiced by Jade DeRoach. Then we have the pup's new gear, as well as new lookout. This is also the first time we see all of it animated. Ready for action, riders, sir? There's also a new deployment song. First of all, Ryder and his monster wheeled ATV is hilariously ridiculous, but I do like his rescue wheels uniform quite a lot. Same can be said for the pups as well, they look very cute with the helmets. I also like the designs of their monster trucks, and if you do as well, like the video and subscribe for more like this. Discussing the lookout, there's a bit to unpack. The original lookout morphs into the rescue wheels headquarters, similar to the mighty pups one. Honestly, it really surprised me. The periscope looks a bit like it turned into a megaphone sort of device, which confuses me a little bit. The exterior of the space where they hold the missing briefings is obviously supposed to resemble a monster truck's tire. When they are about to go down the slide, there's a 3, 2, 1, go light, which I thought was a very nice touch. And when they actually head down the slide, we get a bit of fireworks, which seems very similar to the Moto Pups deployment sequence. My thoughts on the deployment song, a bit rocky for my taste, honestly. But regardless, I'm very excited to see more of Rescue Wheels, and if you are too, check out my previous videos on Rescue Wheels right there. Watch that video that's been chosen just for you. And as always, I'll see you next time.